Korean barbecue is enjoying tremendous popularity these days. Why? Well, think about the flavor profile. It's sweet, it's spicy, it's fiery, and it also brings in lots of vegetables. You'll need one special ingredient for the pork shoulder. It's called gojujang, and it's a Korean spice paste made of fermented soybeans, rice, chili peppers, garlic, and salt. You can find it at any Asian market. Here's our pork shoulder. It has marinated in the gojujang for 48 hours. And this is the newest addition to the Project Smoke family. It's a Kalamazoo charcoal smoker cabinet. The way it works is you open the charcoal hatch and fill it with charcoal. Close the hatch. Now here's how a gravity-fed charcoal smoker works. You pull out and lift the fire door. Then you pull out the ash chamber. Then add hardwood chunks to the ash pan. Return it to the fire chamber and lower the fire door. And here are the brains of the operation. Use this controller to set the temperature of the smoke chamber. So I'll press the fit button, push the button to the desired temperature. 225 degrees, your classic smoking temperature. Thanks to its insulation, it's hermetically sealed, so it burns an incredibly long time, at least 18 hours on one load of charcoal. This is the smoke chamber where we'll smoke the pork. So pull out the food rack and take your pork shoulder and place it in the smoker. Insert the temperature probe. Then slide in the drawer. Smoking time, eight to 10 hours at 225 degrees. Fast forward eight hours. And here's your pork shoulder. So take out the thermometer probe. And this pork is so tender, it's almost falling apart. Now use these meat shredders to pull the meat off the bone. And you can see how tender this is. It just shreds effortlessly. And take a look, we have a beautiful smoke ring. This pork is gonna be amazing.